Oh, you're probably going to see this vlog in three months like it's been. I'm sorry, I've just gotten behind on a little bit of everything lately. But today is an exciting day because tomorrow I'm going to go on my first hunt. Like, first real hunt. I, I stabbed that boar with a knife that one time in Florida. And then we shot, shot iguanas out of a tree. Get him again. But I've never been on an actual hunt. And Evan Hafer hit me up and was like, hey, I got a spare tag for an elk. Would you like it? And so we're go going up to where uh, in Utah where Joe Rogan goes and hunts. And we're going to spend a couple days up there and hopefully I'll get me an elk. Oh, yeah. I had to buy hunting gear because I've never hunted before. <laughs> Red Jays grew up in Alabama, never hunted. How crazy is that? Heather's coming with. She's going to go find skulls while we're up there. As you can tell, we made it to Utah. We here now. We her. We decided to get a little bit earlier flight than uh, than Brandon. Wait do you see the gun that Brandon brought for the elk hunt. I'm not gonna spoil it right now. I think we're gonna meet up with Mr. Evan Hafer and grab some food and some coffee or something and just dick around until Brandon gets here. We're staying in a hotel tonight and then we're gonna go north a little bit and uh, get checked in our lodge that we're gonna be at for this hunt. Super excited because it's like my first real hunt. It may be 60 degrees here in Salt Lake City, but I'm from Texas where it's 100 degrees in December. So yeah, jackets on. And I'm new boot goofing. Oop. Never mind. Left my room key in the room and I need that to exit the garage. Oop. Black Rifle gave us a truck to use. I'm gonna fart in it. Brandon Berberba. Hello, sir. How are you? Dude, are you ready to hunt some some, some horses with swords on their heads? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mother of God. You guys have seen Heather's Bronco, and that, that Bronco is expensive. This Bronco is on a next level expensive. Look at this thing. Damn, boy. It's got the, the fake rust paint on it and everything. Dude, this thing is freaking sick. Well, I know what I'm doing to Heather's Bronco now. Oh, that beautiful leather. Do you have the ammo on these, They got us some care packages. Some loophole binos. Yeah, so this has here. Sitka pants? Sitka pants? Sitka shirts? Sitka jacket? That's why we gotta stop. Oh, Evan's letting me use his personal nozzler. So that's what I'm gonna get an elk with, hopefully. Hopefully. I'm a shot long range in a minute. So we're gonna go out and zero the rifles right now. Alright, so uh, we, we just drove through some of the most perilous cliffs I've ever driven through. And we've been on these for about 30 minutes now and we're still not there. Fine. We could have died. It was not comfy. That was, I, I felt nervous driving it. There's a group of boys that shouldn't come here. No railings, no nothing. You look out over the side. No, there's 200 foot cliff. Yeah, so imagine this right here on the right, no railing, and it was two to 300 foot of cliff. Yeah, and the, uh, the grade was almost 45 degrees. It was, uh, it was not a fun experience. I am very nervous about going back down that. I think we're gonna need some four low in first gear. For, for that. I swear to God, I thought you were about to say a four loco. <laughs> I, dude, after like, that, damn, dude. <laughs> my, ner my nerves are a little shot. I might need a drink after that one. Oh, or like 17. Dude, someone drove the Black Rifle RV up here. I, I hated doing that in a truck without a trailer. That's ridiculous. This is cool. So pretty much we're all bunking with other people who are doing the hunt too, who aren't part of our group. <sighs> Brandon hates taxidermy. This altitude. <laughs> <laughs> People can't know my weaknesses. <laughs> <laughs> this altitude's no joke, man. It was hard carrying all our shit up here. Heather and I are the only people staying in a room together. And, uh, it's very small. It was very small. No fan. It was small. I'm just out of breath carrying our shit up. I can't wait till we, we're hiking miles. Brandy's room. It's going to be our snack bar because he's got, he's got room for it. For all the essentials. Gun, snacks, and liquor. That's, that's my room. <laughs> 
But anyway, I just brought more snacks up and Brandon and I are huffing and puffing. This altitude is killer. Got a nice buffet, a nice buffet, <laughs> a nice buffet. We still gotta go zero rifle, so no drinking yet, boys. Dude, we are literally in the middle of nowhere after that drive. Look at this. That's the lodge that I showed you our rooms earlier. We're all gonna be staying in there. This is wild. But basically, we all pack up in our trucks, we get our guns, we drive back down the Perilous Trail about halfway, get out, go find elk, shoot them. Damn, these grasshoppers be going at it. Yeah, get it, boy. Feels so bad. Dude, I'm out of breath from walking from the truck. Jesus, I gotta work on my cardio. Well, and we're the highest altitude ever. That's my guy. And that's what Brandon's shooting. <laughs> it's car 20. Go big or go home. Do I? Go big or go home. Okay, so there's zero. We have four targets out here. Yep. So we have four pieces of steel. There's a fox on the right. Yep, I see the fox. And we were shooting at the piece of steel right there. Shot. Let me shoot it. Sure thing. And then. Everybody good on ears? Yeah. Everybody good on ears? Yep. Going hot. Same place. Okay, I'm going hot. See? What, do, what kind of what caliber is this? 6.5. Okay. Yeah, I, that so let's go back to the right. Whatever do you want to put a finger in my butt later? Yeah, totally. There we go. What is this? He can hear what we're saying. Oh. <laughs> That's why you're being going hot. Around. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good one. That center orange dot. Yes. Yeah, so boom, boom, boom. Put it above that. Should I, be, should I be changing, like, up, get down, and in, or yeah. just know where the where to aim? Go and shoot Fire. it one more time. Good. You ready? Yep. All right. Fire him. Okay. So, do you want to do it more What's... realistic to how we're going to be hunting? Yeah. Okay, let me get my... I'm going to have a table at the... <laughs> A little bit high, but there's holes right there, so shoot the one on the right. So I can okay. see it Ready? Yep. What am I doing wrong? That was way high, huh? That might have been me. Oh. What am I doing wrong? You know where you're hitting? I don't know where I'm hitting. Hmm. Can't really see it on, on that paper. That's concerning. Ready? Good? We're done? You need me to go out? So we're out here zeroing the gun that Evan gave me. And it's not his fault, but I think something might be wrong with the optic. We're not sure yet. It's shooting six feet high at the moment. All right, ready? Over the board. Yeah, well this one's, I think, unless... He's, he, he's up here tonight. <coughs> he should be here soon. Yeah, he said he should be here by now. Yeah, to go down, I mean, we'd have to go... And it locks out at 10. Because by going all this way, it's just going up. That's, oh... That's not what we want. Is that like a fucking 30 MOA rail? Yeah. And the other thing, and I don't want to screw with his gun, but you got to undo this. So what we do, we take it off, get it to where we need, and then you lock it back in a zero stop at that. Just kind of reset it. But, yeah, I mean, for tonight, I have him mess with that. I don't want to yeah, screw anything up with this stuff. We 
drove another 20, 30 minutes onto further in the middle of nowhere. Brandon's got his scar. He's gonna try to get something right now. We're gonna go until the sun starts to go, go down. Oh yeah, I get to carry a scar 20 up this hill. Think about how to rig this to my pack. I don't know if there's a good way. Facing down would be ideal, right? And then you can latch it onto the handle or something. Oh yes. Cody. Winning. Oh, here you go.
I didn't record dinner at all. I should have. That was a fantastic crock pot, crock pot chicken and rice. Hey. <laughs> Cody and Brandon sleep in that bed. I'm sitting in the cook well, chair. Well, no, I was about to. I was chair. about to say Brandon Heather's in the cuck chair. Oh boy! <laughs> oh boy! Here, Here we, we go. go. <laughs> I had to get up at 4.30 to make it to breakfast down there. Oh, oh God. Today's going to be a good day. Our second day here, and we decided Brandon's going to get the first kill. And then once I get, get my kill, then we're going to head back home. It's Tuesday today. They said we could stay here till Saturday to get our kill. But I think we're going to get it before then. Our guide, Logan, is fucking awesome. Learned a lot yesterday about tracking down some elks. So let's take this bad boy and try to bag us one. So the gun that Evan loaned me yesterday, they had put the wrong scope rings on it and it wasn't working correctly. It was shooting like six feet high and there was nothing we could do to adjust it. I'm out of breath going up the stairs, dude. This, ele this elevation is... It's f We're gonna be walking all over the mountains again today. But this is a light rifle. This is uh, another one that Evan is loaning out to me. This isn't a Nosler, this is a 6.5 Creedmoor, and it's got the suppressor on it. This thing's pretty dope. That's how you do it at the, the AK Guy Incorporated. Adapt, improvise, overcome. Or just come. Just come. <laughs> so you didn't have a sling yesterday, that kind of sucked, huh? That was not great. Although I, you know, I figured it out. Just assembling the scar and putting it in the backpack wasn't bad, but it's not, it's not optimal. <laughs>
bitches. One with maidens. Never gonna take them. I don't know what we're gonna do with them, but they're ours now. We own them. <laughs> we own all your bitches. Those trees look ominous as out there. Did you, did you have a good shot? Yeah. It was clean. What was, hey, Brandon, what happened on the close one? What's up? When he was close, what happened? The gun wasn't loaded. Oh, my ears again. Right yeah. the, Sorry, dude. I knew I was going to have them, but I'm like, worth it. So, I think he did. I thought you heard him fall, didn't you? Did you guys hear him fall? I watched him fall. Okay. Yeah, there's a, another one. Well, get ready. Twofer. That's cool. I'll make sure this one's dead. Count our eggs before they hatch again.
10 yards. Anybody can relay to Kenny, we got one down. Logan and Kenny is back here. Yes, we got one down. Pretty similar to where Wade was Saturday. Nose up and run off. <laughs> <laughs> well, that looks cool. Did you get that on video? Yeah. Every time you turn around. <laughs> yeah, every time I cock off. Wait. <laughs> Pussy. <laughs> that, is the, that is the hunting equivalent of there are hot singles in your area. <laughs> Dude, I could have got that one from standing. Yeah, it was Dude, close. He was so close. <laughs>
awesome. And the scar, yeah. the scar eight. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Congratulations, man. That's fucking awesome. I tell you what, I'm happy to not have to carry that scar anymore. <laughs> you passed the torch. Yes. Is that you're you gonna you gonna run the scar? No, I'm um, running I'm running Evan's gun. Are you gonna like just check it out first? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Logan's gonna take me down there to check it out. Does the is the scar 20s? So it's like they're more heavy duty, like precision gun, the 6.5. So, uh, yeah, it's like 15 pounds unloaded. Oh, shit. Not a trekking gun. No. But boy, is he going to look cool on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs>
intriguing. First one, you can hear it. Smash. I don't know if I got him the second time, but I got him the third time. Yeah. Too. Okay, let's get down there. Mm, that was cold too. <laughs> that was yeah, a little shaky. Like, Dude, you're shaking. So how? What's the distance? Three thirty. So are we walking down there? Yeah. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Three thirty. That kind of sucks, man. That kind of sucks to be down. Yeah. What's up? I said it kind of sucks to be done. <laughs> I want to keep hunting. <laughs> Dude, that first one smacked it. I heard it. <laughs> that sounded gnarly. Because I knew he got hit, but I knew he got hit good because he didn't run. No. He kept putting his head down like, what the shit? Just... Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good. Had to kill him right in the holler, huh? <laughs> <Or> the waller. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. He's a nice one. Look at those fronts, man. You can get better fronts than that. Yeah, you could. You could have maybe got him out of the mud. Six, Brandon. Twenty inches. Of course, I killed him at the the top of the wall, the waller where they piss and shit and roll around in it to impress the females. And he rolled right back into the waller with all the piss and shit. Thanks, man. Nice job, Cody. <laughs> You have a knife on you? I do. It's cute. <laughs> you trying to shake someone with that? Bears penises are ivory. What? what?